Space. The final frontier. These are the voyages of a new Trekkie. My five year mission to search out Star Trek media, to seek out our fans and merchandise, to boldly go where no fan has gone before. Greetings and salutations, hope everyone's doing good. Welcome all my Star Trek friends, as well as anyone who has, anyone, I suppose. Whether you're a visitor or just checking us out. Um, today we'll be discussing the film, Please Stand By. <laughs> So, someone was, someone was this fil the film Stand By Me. Well, the f film Stand By Me is about a young girl on the, on the autism spectrum who is a big fan of Star Trek, writes in a draft for a Star Trek writing contest, and is basically is really dedicated to trying to get all the way to Los Angeles to deliver it personally. Mostly because, like, well, her family is, like, she lives, mostly because her family is not, and her, her family and her primary caregiver are not very, like, you know, they aren't really for that of her going there to get it. So she gets her, decides to go all the way from there to Los Angeles to deliver herself. And my god, I'm gonna say this. This film's really good. It's really good. I'm gonna say at times I felt I kind of saw myself in this film. Like it is it is so good, honestly. Mostly just because the acting is good, the cast is great, the even though like say there's not effects, the effects when there are are great. Everyone does a fantastic job in this film. Heck I gotta say, like, some highlights of this movie are, like, even, like, say, when we see, uh, Patton Oswalt, he plays a cop in the film. One way he, like, um, when, because of Benny's character, Wendy, she is trying to, like, she's, like, almost about to get to where she needs to be to drop in her draft. She gets stopped by the police, and one way she, one way the, uh, Patton Oswalt get, gets her to come out is by... Um, like, um, he basically talks to her in Klingon. Nadeb your horse! Nadeb your horse! What language is that? It's Klingon. So, oh. And I, I know that, like, a lot of people still say, hey, that Star Trek can be, you know, quite geeky or anything like that. But I'm gonna say, after watching this film, like, one thing that I've discovered from having watch the show like as well as watch these films and having done like other little topics involving trek i gotta say that trek one thing i in my opinion is that it really like it can get to a person and that you can see yourself in the characters and go wow i'm like spock and that someone like, it's hard for someone to control their emotions. Or, like, say, like, maybe they see themselves as Pap Captain Picard and that they have the ability to be a leader, but at the same time, they might have flaws. I mean, you, and honestly, like, say, the one thing that makes great, Star Trek great is the characters like say the way they're written and all that you can feel like you might actually know a person similar to that so i mean there's like one moment and like made me extremely cry honestly is like say wendy is like walk after her dog pees on the bus and you're not allowed to have pets she um one thing that happens is she ends up getting robbed by some as uh, someone and also, most, someone also tries to steal our money at a rip her off at a convenience store. Get him! Get him! I know the 
but my god, I gotta say this film is really good in the fact that you can relate to the characters, the, like, say, I, I don't know, I, one way I can say about this is the film has heart. It truly does, and the fact that you can kind of care about these characters, you might know them, like someone some, who might be of the spectrum of autism. I gotta say the fact that compared to some films that I might have seen, like say music, they tr like say the way Wendy is written and that she feels like a real person and like say the way they do the like say the autism parts like where the frustration or the part where they're having to get restrainer. It also even though Someone might it seems it is quite realistic. It seem, it seems to be done in a respectful manner. Can you please tell Audrey that I'm ready to go home now? Please stand by. Instead of perhaps tasteless, like say something like say music. If the only thing I'm gonna say is good about music is that music is the music from the film. Yeah, I'm sorry I had to go on a tangent there, but I gotta say this film is good. The acting is good, the, like, you know, the theme of it, the, like, say, believing in oneself. Do you know how hard it is to write something because the story you want to tell means so much to you? That is always one thing I get to say. That seems like a great ideal for Trek as well. But what do you guys think of this film? I think it's really good. But what do you guys think? Put your thoughts and comments down below. Let me know. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. See you later. Thank you.